but he's averaging 15 rebounds a game as he throws this one away. Long ahead, Cubbage streaking to the basket. Meg Grevers averaging 18 turnovers a game. That right there is their fifth. Moreno ahead for Higgins. The extra pass for Emilian. Touches. Moreno off the mark and a three, but an offensive rebound for Cubbage. Extra pass back to Higgins. And Rob Higgins has five for St. Francis and nine nothing lead. Well, I mean, you have to <laughs> really establish position. You want to get a base. You have to know angles. Outside Higgins for three. Knocks it down. Got it into the high post. The kick out and Higgins wide open. On these things, so you don't want to foul him. Here's Andre Evans. Looking for the first Cougars point of the game, and he gets it. Took over at Mount St. Vincent's College as their head coach. Off the miss, ahead for a million to the basket. Gets the layup and the foul. Meg Rivers also playing without their leading scorer this season tonight. As the three from Tedrick Wilcox Jr. goes down for the right wing. Finds Surag in the corner for three. Rebound for Wilcox. Back to Surag cutting on the baseline. Looking inside, no good for Sinera. And the rebound save, but it goes to Surag. Three on two the other way. Whoa. Terriers by 29, but a three-pointer the other way for Dante Simmons. Montague Street shot that. Evans, no good. Break it out. Wilcox calling for it. He's heating up. Threw it away. Still up for grabs. Wilcox wide open. He cannot miss. Give him the ball, Joe. Why not? Casper Surag lays it underneath, and that is Max Egner. Well executed. Give the Terriers credit. Spin move for Joshua Jean-Pierre. This free throw, it should put him at double figures. Didn't want to jinx yeah. him right there. But uh... here's Egner. Kick it out. Wilcox, an open look for three. He gets that one. 18 points for Tedrick Wilcox. Here's Evans, looking to drive up over Vuk Stevenich and gets it to go. Now he's the head coach at ASA Manhattan and their women's basketball team and has been at the College of New Rochelle before that as Idara gets the layup. Dynamic player. Yeah, there, there, were, ma there were many of them, but uh, you know, he, he, he brought energy. It was great to see. Here's Cubbage to the basket, gets nice the bucket. Finish. Moreno. Higgins drives, splits the defense, and gets the layup. My home borough. Simmons was soft on the three, ahead for high dark. Peters win on Saturday against Delaware State. It's Jack Hempel with a two handed slam. Steal for Cotterell. And it's blocked from behind by Max Egner. How about that defensive play? That was a good chase down. And Quartelbaum the other up way. On the play. For the Terriers is Quartelbaum now the 10th different player to score for St. Francis tonight. Basketball was four quarters. Mm -hmm. NBA basketball was four quarters. By the way, this is the first time this season that the Terriers have gotten a Across the 80-point threshold, Gonzalez gets the bucket and the bench erupts for the Terriers. Play some guys who don't normally see a lot of minutes, some extended time. Well, Hardison picked up some fouls quickly in the first half. Hope. Surag. Bartlebaum for three. Left a little short. Chases down his own rebound, though. And gets the floater. Trey Quartelbaum, 11 second-half points. Not only is he a student athlete, a full-time student, and has to deal with everything that goes along with that, as Elisha Hardison on the take, gets the bucket and the foul. Right on chugging on with this season. It's Quartelbaum off the mark, offensive rebound, Egner.
Evans was short on the three. Cougars grab the miss. Shovel it back, and that's Johnny Johnson. Nice Freshman. dish. One that's been kind of on the upswing over the last couple of years. Shot no good from Egner. Gets the bucket off the glass. And that will do it here tonight. The Terriers close out their third straight win, a 113-51 victory over Medgar Evers.